You know, the enemy don't mind you dressing up, looking good, and sitting in here. But if you got stuff blocking your mind, you will not receive what God has in store for you. And I've learned over the years that any time you come together in an atmosphere like this, trust and believe that the devil has also assigned some angels to come and try to counteract anything that God is going to do and so what we are about to do is that I needed to find one person and hold on to them if they don't know you say it's, it's all right you don't have to know me right now the only thing you need to know is I'm filled with the Holy Ghost and if I if I don't got it yet I'm gonna get it before the summit is over oh Somebody agree with me tonight. Now, the first thing I notice is that when the plane is going to take off, is that the passengers have to board the plane. So that when you got your ticket, it simply means you have booked your ticket to board Summit 2090. When you went home, and got dressed and you entered the building you are now aboard the flight oh god almighty when the praise and worship did their thing uh, that were the instructors telling you fasten your seat oh! and, and, and just know that there are some exits to your left and to your right oh god i wish somebody could help me up in here i want to tell you tonight that the exits are not for me but the exits are for anything that comes to mess up my life the exit is for depression the exit is the confusion. I wish I had a church up in here. So notify or pay attention to your exits. Now the next thing you do when you sit on the plane is this. You check your neighbor beside you. Who is sitting on your left and who is sitting on your right. I want you to check who's sitting beside you. Check who's sitting behind you you gotta do is you gotta do a road check as well to see who's sitting on the other side of you lord have mercy lord have mercy now i need you to understand this if you're sitting beside somebody who ain't a worshiper you're gonna have a problem because if one person gets a breakthrough on my roll and I'm at the end of the roll get ready get ready it's coming to me so I want you to tell everybody on your say neighbors get ready to take off come on come on now now watch this the plane has to now take its time slowly and get on the Pacific runway <laughs> there are many different runways and so the plane has to go on the right runway then the plane positions itself but while the plane is positioning itself uh, there are some people on the outside uh, checking sure uh, that some stuff is clear uh, I'm here to tell somebody tonight uh, the angels are on the outside and they're checking that it's clear and I just got news you're clear
I fly. I don't know if evangelist gets nervous when the plane is going to take off, but you feel something move in your belly and you feel like I'm getting ready for something. I don't know about you, but I feel something moving in my belly. I feel like I'm getting ready for a major breakthrough, a major release, a major healing. Something is about to shift. Now guess what? I want you to hold on to your neighbor. Hold both hands. Say neighbor, I got news that I'm cleared. So guess what? I'm in Liberty Hall. And it simple means I'm gonna open my mouth and this praise is my takeoff praise. I don't know what you went through today. I don't know what the doctor told you, but this praise 